against Joel Gonzalez Bonilla. Busy times for the Spanish coaching team. Well, Agabush from Jordan. Standing at five foot ten, the twenty-year-old won the Asian Olympic qualifiers and indeed won the World Championships back in 2012. What a performance he has put on today. The men's 68 kilogram semi-final here. Just taking a nice leisurely stroll into the centre of the ring. Gonzalez Bonilla. Yeah, that long trip all the way uh, to, to where they're going to fight uh, this semi-final. And well, they, they do look calm, cool, calm and collected, I've got to say, because uh, I remember my legs being like jelly. <laughs> Of course, the jumping jacks performed here by Ahmad Abugash from Jordan. They need to use their heads and their legs here. Joel Gonzalez Bonilla. And his coach, Antonio Toledo, there. Of course, Olympic champion Gonzalez Bonilla. Studies criminology. We have to be absolutely clinical here. Kim Song Chul, the Canadian. He's the man in the middle. Herman Agabush from Jordan. Gonzalez Bonilla in red. Ahmad Abugash tries again for the headshot there. Abugash as he pushes Bonilla back onto the back foot. Real range of movement. Abugash straight into the attack. Oh, he tries a punch there as well. Did he get it? He got a point for it. So a great point there, Abogos on the offensive. It just snuck in a little punch and a lovely little turning kick as well. And just some nice movement as well. Good confidence from Ahmad Abogos. One point to the good. Yeah, we're talking about confidence and he does, doesn't he? He's coming here ready to fight this. He wants to get through to that final, that's for sure. So you can see it, you can feel it when you're in there fighting as well. Also a good tactic, jumping up against the taller fighter. Trying to change the visual perception of the fighter to throw them off. Throw them off guard and fire a shot under the guard. He did it. With some success earlier, not so there. Well blocked by the Spanish fighter. Well, that's your action reaction there you're talking about, John, because that's exactly what it is, isn't it? Getting them to make a reaction that they don't want to do and uh, putting them uh, one foot forward that they don't want to put forward. Been an engaging first round and a good one so far. Back kick as well. Now that will make it a lot better for them. Ahmad Abugash. Brilliant three-point back kick from the man from Jordan. He's going to close this one out here with the front leg. Joel Gonzalez Bonilla, Olympic champion. Four points down at the end of the first round. That was right on the button, wasn't it? It really was. Accuracy with the spin and uh, big points, of course. That, that uh, puts him four ahead. What a nice position to be in. Absolutely. And what an excellent back kick as well. Yeah, it was brilliant, wasn't it? Look at that. As you see, spinning around and what a big difference it makes. And the overhead shot just shows you the distance between the two. And here's the technique. Well, it just really hit the target. Everything was right about it. And <laughs> he knew it as well. <laughs> a round of applause for yourself. <laughs> Sometimes it's the only one I ever get. <laughs> the pedigree and experience coming into it. 
double world champion gold medal in London. He's going for gold here. Ahmad Abogash from Jordan. It's Joel Gonzalez Bonilla of Spain. And this one, six minutes to decide. I was just about to say, how will the tactics change now? Well, it's a difficult one for Gonzalez Bonilla. He loves to counter attack. But when you're four points ahead, you don't need to go forward. However, Ahmad Abogash is a very aggressive style of fighter, so he does commit. He commits himself with a good push kick there. Bonilla really needs to try and change stance. Throw a bit of difference in there. Get a bit of confusion. Get himself onto the scoreboard here. Still plenty of time though. Ties with his own back kick very close. He's really come here to fight, hasn't he? Abogash here has decided that it's all about offence and he's just coming forward all the time and he's accurate as well. Totally agree. He's decided to come and take it and he takes it with another back kick there. Technique and timing. He closes the door. Seven to the good there. Both back kick scoring. Both taking a kill goal. Oh, that was fantastic. I mean, th this is against the uh, Olympic champion, by the way. So, you know, it's it's real quality here. He's fighting. Yeah, he's been tremendous all day. Defeated Ide Hoon, the Olympic silver medalist in the previous round. He's now going against Gonzalez Bonilla, Olympic champion in this semi-final. Well, if I was his coach, I'd definitely be saying just don't change this because you're totally dominating this match and, you know, don't change your tactics. And it'd be interesting to see what happens in the last two minutes, but uh, he's still got 20 seconds here to go. But uh, don't change it. He's been uh, so successful so far. It's not broke. Don't fix it. And with 10 seconds left, Ashab has fixed his gaze on the final. Has to keep the pressure on Gonzalez Bonilla. And he certainly has. At the end of an engrossing second round. We'll talk about quality, the high scoring techniques, the value, the timing that you have to throw those techniques. Perfection from Ashab, and it comes from the mindset. It, yeah, it does, very much so. And uh, it is the mindset. You can see he came in, he was ready to fight. He was ready to take the fight to him. Look at that, right on the button there, and uh, and almost there with that one as well. You know, so it's almost a double kick. Fantastic stuff. Exactly right. Throws the first back kick, almost gets the second. But at the end of that second round, where well, you can see the scoreboard flickering in the background. Antonio Toledo, last minute bits of advice for the Spanish Olympic champion Joel Gonzalez Bonilla. This, the semi final in the men's 68 kilogram grouping. Ahmad Abogash, seven to the good. Abogash on the front foot. Very good reactions, just takes his time. Very calm back kick attempt there from Gonzalez. And it's a push kick straight away from Abogash. You said don't change the tactics. Well, he shouldn't do. Uh, and, you know, from everything that I've seen here now, that third third period certainly matches are won or lost, and he needs to just do what he's, just, uh, what he's been doing the whole match here, dominating and just picking up the points. Brilliant stuff. Ahmad Abogash really performing well here. Joel Gonzalez Bonilla has the head kick potential. The defence so far from the man from Jordan, so good. Almost walks into a back kick, he does that time, but there's a big push kick. And the Spanish fighter, well, he's away into the Copacabana. <laughs> Slips down the side, I hope he's OK there. Yeah, it's quite a, a steep side on the way down. Eight points to three. And it's the long walk home for him, has to come back up the steps. And waiting for him at the top of those steps. This man here. Yeah, and coming forward as well. Now he's on the attack now. Gonzalez Bonilla is absolutely got nothing to lose here now. And he can feel that his Olympic title is 
just slipping away from him. Coming up to the last minute. Trying to put on the pressure. Back kick attempt there from the Spanish fighter, Gonzalez Bonilla, as you see. Six points gap. Well, this is certainly where the gamesmanship comes in. I've seen that, you know, and the thing is, is that this man here, Abgush, has, uh, well, he's got another three points, and he's taken it up to 12. And I was going to say that he's been just attacking all the way through, and he's the first one that I've seen that's uh, kept on attacking as well, even being ahead. Absolutely correct. He got the tactics right, he got the timing right, he lands another back kick, and he's having an absolute party here at the Carioca Arena. He's spinning around both body and head of Gonzalez Bonilla, who is just heading out of this Olympic Games final contention. Ahmad Abagush, what a performance. Takes a headshot there on the way through. We know that the potential's there for Gonzalez Bonilla, but the time and indeed the Jordanian look as if they have beaten the Spanish fighter. Ahmad Abagush finishes with a reverse turning kick. Finishes with real style there. Great moment for athlete and coach Ahmad Abagush. He's into the Olympic Games final and what a tremendous performance from start to finish. Just perfect. That was absolute brilliance, wasn't it? And uh, well, I'm not sure whether he actually scored with that spinning uh, headshot there at the end, but that was he didn't need it. It was brilliant. He absolutely uh, took it to Gonzalez Planilla and he took it to him from the very beginning. Never stopped, he was always coming forwards, he didn't need to change his tactics, and he absolutely didn't change his tactics, did he? And that, I think, won him the match. I think, totally agree, that was the conversation we had, as we see the confirmation there. Ahmad Abagush into the Olympic Games final.